Okay, so we've got ourselves the last minute unplanned uh, rehousing that we have to do. Uh, I knocked this enclosure right here that's got the spider in it off of this shelf right down here. It was right next to Phoebe's enclosure. I pulled her enclosure out. Uh, somehow that damn thing slid out with it, fell off, landed on the floor upside down. I righted it back up right and then thought, well, great, now I've got to redo its enclosure, but I thought, I'm going to redo its enclosure. Why not rehouse it? It's going to need a bigger house here pretty soon anyway. So we're going to go ahead and get the camera set up and then we'll rehouse this spider really quick. All right. So in here is my wolf spider, the Hogna Schmitzi, the Porto Santo wolf spider. You can see it's substrate and everything is just all screwed up since I knocked it off the shelf. Um, I'm pretty sure that the spider is okay because it lives in a mass of substrate and moss and webbing and stuff that is attached to the bottom of this cork bark and I fully expected it. Oh, there it is. There it is. Hold on. Let me put this whole thing in here and then we'll get a look at it. I just found it. It's on the other side of the uh, cork bark. I knew it would be fine. All right. So. There it is right down there. You might be able to just make it out. That is my Porto Santo wolf spider. It is fine and dandy. Uh, that piece of cork bark that it's on. Hold on, guys. There it is. Isn't that a beautiful wolf spider? So this piece of cork bark right here, it's been using that ever since uh, I rehoused it the first time. And since it's not on it right now, I can show you see how it made this big mass of webbing and and uh, moss and all kinds of stuff and that was attached to the bottom side of the uh, cork bark there and you can see I believe that looks like a molt to me yes indeed it is so it just recently molted it looks like that's cool we'll lay this thing back down here and it'll uh, do what it wants with it as far as making its new den or whatever but i just threw this in here because i just had it laying around i had it in another wolf spider enclosure but that wolf spider died but there we go i believe this wolf spider oh it's gonna run and hide from us is pretty freshly molted so that's really cool but um i'll probably try to do a feeding video on it in a week or two and that probably won't work out because it usually doesn't but there we go i avoided crisis the spider was not harmed when i knocked the enclosure off and it got a new house out of the deal sorry the end of that video turned out kind of crappy i just wasn't paying a whole lot of attention this just kind of rushed anyway if you enjoyed it let me know with a thumbs up and a comment don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't done that share this video with your friends Always, always, guys, take care of yourselves and each other. Have a great day or a great night wherever you are. Thanks so much for watching, guys. God bless.